Um, all right, now joining us on the blower, <laughs> we're going for a little three-way here. We have from Wallabies Camp, Matt Gibbon, and from Mad Monday, Alex Gibbon. Yeah, <laughs> how are we, lads? <laughs> Alex, uh, you're looking pretty good, man. How are you holding up? You won a you won a second grade grand final yesterday, didn't you? Yeah, I'm hurting, mate. I'm hurting a lot. <laughs> Alex, oh, yeah, man. Talk, talk, talk well, we us, won. Yeah, <laughs> talk us through the day, mate. Obviously, you, you were you captain as well, Alex. Captain, coach. Yeah, mate. I'm the I'm captain and coach, so I can pick myself. But um, <laughs> no, that was good as first. First time uh, in 42 years at the clubs to be in a final, and uh, obviously first time we've been back up and running the last, I think, 10 years or something. So yeah, it was really good, and we got the win. We actually smashed Ballina, uh, 33 points to 12, I think. But uh, yeah, afterward was yeah pretty good. The last couple of days, I got to see Matt there for a little while, having a few beers before Wallabies campaign. Hey, Matt, it was good. <laughs> what are you talking about, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, the Eagles started early. I love it. <laughs> oh, brilliant. But, Matt, yeah, yeah, no, I haven't slept yet, mate. It's been a good weekend. <laughs> Hell, yeah. We're used to seeing you shred on the Aussie Sevens field, obviously an outside back when you were playing Super Rugby. I can imagine as the coach and the captain, and I think these guys are saying the club president, <laughs> Playing, you're probably you're probably not going to pick yourself on the wing. What what position did you play yesterday in the grand final or on Saturday? Uh, start started at nine and ended up playing five eight. Yes, that's <laughs> that is that is the exact combination. I'll, I'd probably go the reverse. I'd start at ten and move to nine. Um, yeah, I started I started playing tight end prop at the start of the season, but my wife told me she'd leave me if I kept doing that. So. <laughs> Oh, but touching on that, Alex, it, it is a, it's a, it's a very unique story. Your one, obviously, as as Dot alluded to, um, in the sevens <coughs> arena for four or five seasons, and then and um, you know played a bit at NRC, but then you decided to go back home to the Northern Rivers, and you got was it is it Richmond Range back up and running, a, a club that was almost or had been defunct. You've now got it up and running. You got a women's side, all that sort of stuff going. Like, run us through that little uh, arc in the story. Well, we moved to the area and uh, obviously I wasn't going to stop playing yet. Um, but uh, I found that there was a lot of young guys in our area that were just getting on the piss and had nothing else to do. And I decided to to talk to a few people about the old club that used to be going. I think they uh, recently closed in 2007 or something like that. That was the last time they had a, a team. Um, so my wife and I got with some locals and, yeah, said we'll have a training session. And I thought, you know, we might get 15 or 20 people. We ended up getting like 45 people rock up and I was like what the hell am I going to do here <laughs> um which is pretty pretty unbelievable but um yeah only five blokes had ever played rugby union uh, the rest of them had either played league or no team sport at all and then that was right when COVID hit so we did two two seasons in a row in third grade in President's Cup and made the finals but obviously they never got played because of COVID um and then this year they were going to get rid of President's Cup altogether and we decided to go into the second grade comp and yeah, we won that. So the rest is history. Hell yeah! But yeah, it's been a good show. What a story! That's awesome, eh? Yeah. And um, and Alex, we're um, you got you and Paige are obviously really good friends with Kane and Jen Douglas. Um, yeah. I grew pretty close with Kane uh, when I came back to the Reds in 2018, I think, and we keep we keep in touch. And he's been talking to me about post rugby life. Um, would you give him a gig at the uh, Richmond Rangers? Uh, of course I would, mate. We <laughs> suck at line outs. <laughs> well, that's, I, I, said, I, said, mate, I said, mate, mate sh- your second rowers aren't watching, eh? <laughs> They're like sitting in a beer. <laughs> <laughs> he hates oh. me. <laughs> yeah. oh, They'll be passed out. <laughs> <laughs>